finally doing my car tour. This is super long awaited and I've been driving this car for about a year now. But now that I'm off to California, I thought I'd get this out of the way finally for you guys. So a little bit about the car before we get started. And if you were wondering, yes, I am shipping the car out to California with me. So we'll have my baby with me and it's kind of impossible not to have a car over there. So a little bit about the car. This is a 2009 Lincoln MKZ. I did not buy this car because this car was my grandma's and now she's my guardian angel. So this is the car. It is this nice green color and it's all wheel drive. And then I'm just going to tour the car for you guys. I'm not a car girl. I don't really know specific things about it. So if you're interested in this car and the model and all that stuff there's always Google. Then the camera guy will just take us around the car I'll show you the outside of the car and then we'll go inside. So here's the front of the car and here's the grill and then come around and we have the MKZ logo right here. Okay so the side view mirrors are mirrored over here. We have this keypad which I don't know the code for and it's not even programmed, I don't think. And then you come around and here is my gas tank. It's on the left side of the car. You open it up like that. And there's the dirty gas tank, lovely. Here are the tires. They just have the Lincoln logo and yeah. And then you come around to the back of the car. So here's the back. This is the trunk, I can open it up with my keys right now. In here, there's just, these are for the winter time, which I'm gonna give to my dad. They're to cover the front of the car so that when it's outside, you could just rip it off and the snow will come with it so you don't have to scrape. And I just have the mats that came with the car in here, but I did buy my own mats. Okay, so then we have the Lincoln logo again. Lincoln, MKZ all wheel drive. And then here, I have a YouTube bumper sticker that Vin gave me for my birthday and Christmas. And then here I have the Fashion Institute of Design and Merchandising sticker right here. So just a little personal touch to the car. And then just come around and the same thing on the side over here. Same thing with the tires. The antenna is right on the top over there. Let's go inside. So here are my keys. I have this little pouch thing that I believe I got on Charming Charlie and you zip it open and I just have cash and stuff like that. My license. Here's the key, I have a pom-pom, and then some keychains. So then, unlocking the car. Okay, so, I'm gonna sit in here. So here's just what the door looks like. We have a speaker, unlock, just the windows, the mirror, uh, adjuster, and all that sort of stuff. Okay, so here's the inside. Now, here's what it looks like from my view. Here's the car on the inside. So over here is the dash and then here is my radio and here I have air conditioner, all that stuff, cold seats, hot seats, hazard lights, all the things are set up here. And here's the wheel, we have the Lincoln logo with this dark wood. Okay, and then here are all like the speedometer and all that stuff, my gas, and the car is not on right now. I'll show you turning it on in a second. And here, of course, are my vents for air and heat. And here is my option for lights, which the car is off right now, so it's not letting me. And on the wheel, this is very convenient. I have a volume option, a skip station, all that stuff. And I didn't hook my phone up. I have to go through the manual and find it. But of course, we could beep the horn, but I'm not going to do that right now because the mailman's right here. I keep my phone thing. And then over here, we have the gears and you just press down and then pull. And then here's the parking brake. Down here, we got the brake and the gas. Here's my center console. And I'll show you what's in here in a second when Finn comes in. In. and here's what it looks like right here so Finn come on in okay so now I'm gonna turn the car on this is what it's like 
to drive with Adiel. So nothing special, just turning the car on, got radio. Up here we have the lights of course, and here you can set it up for your garage, but I have this garage thing up here. Ben can show you, it has the mirrors, and I can look in the mirror, and it lights up, which is convenient. The glove compartment, usually I have a plastic bag hanging from this corner right here for my garbage. So, like I said, put it in different gears. And then I'll give you a little tour of what's in here. In here I have my aux cord plug and I also have a USB plug in there and here's my aux cord. And usually I have to take this Mophie case off in order for it to fit in here and then plug it in through my phone. I have the iPhone 6 so I could still use this but soon I won't be able to. But in here this little bag is a girl emergency bag and it has penny liners, pads, tampons, you never know. And even if I have a friend in the car that needs one of them. And then there's all my basic necessities that are usually in my school bag. So I have little teeth things, a pen, a hairbrush, a lotion, hand sanitizer, deodorant because I can't tell you how many times I accidentally ran out the house in the rush without putting deodorant on and it's not a good feeling. And then I have this little skin serum. This is some sunscreen and slash moisturizer and attached is a little chapstick. I have some Advil, chapstick, a pencil. And then I keep some hair ties. I have this scent bird perfume thing. And I also have bobby pins and mini hair ties. And now bobby pins, a little story. This year, this past year, um, I was running late to school and I was wearing this jumpsuit and it was a silver jumpsuit you could probably find in my Out of the Weeks. And it was a spaghetti strap jumpsuit and it was held by a little plastic ring and the plastic ring snapped and broke. So the strap was hanging and I had no other way. I was about to go home, but thankfully I had a bobby pin in my car. So I just bobby pinned the little hole to the other connective hole and just, it worked out. So always keep bobby pins in your car. You never know, even if you don't use them for your hair, they're very useful. I probably should keep safety pins in here too, just in case an outfit is too big or anything like that, you never know. Um, also in here, this little box thing that came with the car some coins and an air freshener that I recently got but it has my um, car wash place address on it so can't show that here's the back from my view and over there is a pillow that my grandma always had in the car and of course I'd keep it in there for good luck and I'll show you what it says when we get back there so this is the back of the car and I'm just gonna sit in it, which feels really weird because I'm never in the back seat of my own car, obviously, but. On this side in the back pocket, I keep an umbrella um, in case it rains, of course, and also a water bottle usually. And you could pull this out and ooh, there's a cup holder for the passengers. And then here is the pillow. It says families are like quilts, lives pieced together, stitched with smiles and tears, colored with memories and bound with love. So that just lays right here. And then of course, here are the seats. Here are the mats to the car and you have a pocket here too. And this is just the back seat. <laughs> this is what it's like to be a passenger in my car when you're sitting in the back seat. But I'm gonna put the speakers on right now so I can show you what it sounds like. <laughs> And yeah, this is my car. I hope you guys enjoyed it and this video was worth the wait. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. And also, if you're new to my channel, my name is Adiel Jurgensen. I make beauty and fashion videos and I post every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday at 7 p.m. Eastern. I would love it if you checked the rest of my videos out and stuck around. But thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all so much and I'll see you guys next time. Bye everyone. Here, in here I have my aux cord hole, I guess. Quag. In here I have my, <laughs> look at it, man, I got it polished. It's polished with the clear coat. License plate's not in there. Well, you want me to put it in? There you go.